to meet you. I'm the uh, headmaster. You are Mr. Cod. James Cod. Okay, uh, do you want to take a seat over there and we can uh, get the interview started, shall we? Uh, well, uh, thank you for sending in your uh, resume. We were pretty impressed with your application. You're pretty solid uh, all the way through. Although, uh, I've had one slight issue uh, with it. Uh, you do appear to be on the um, sex offenders register. Well, mistakes happen. Well, fair enough, I guess. Um, yeah, uh, apart from that... Oh, no, one other slight thing. Uh, I'm looking at your references here from your past uh, companies. Uh, it does seem to give me the impression that you make false promises towards your employers. I promise you now, that won't happen. Well, thank you uh, very much for coming. Congratulations, you start on Monday. Thank you very much. HMP Wandsworth is a young, experienced individual, a great preacher of the physical sciences. He's a great catch. Okay, so we've got the basic equation, V squared times D all over 2. Okay, so if we look at page 135 in your books, uh, who knows the answer to question 1? Page 135, not page 2, boy. This is the uh, physics department around here. These two classrooms here are mainly physics. That one over there is physics as well. This is actually where we're planning on building our uh, hadron collider in the future. <laughs> anyway, um, uh, if we go into here, I can show you one of our finest new teachers, Mr. Cod. This is a um, A level physics class. Uh, this is Mr. Cod, one of our finest teachers. It's me. It's me. What are you getting on with at the moment? A uh, bit of aerodynamics? Oh, yeah, just a bit of aerodynamics, yeah. Oh, excellent. Shall I go and show you the chemistry department? Oh, yes, please. Alright, let's go. Uh, you're not going to apologise for disrupting my lesson? Sorry? Oh, just kidding, you rap scat and you never get the door. Ah! Oh, are you okay? ah! Get off of me! Cod speaking. Hey Jimbo, how's it going? Oh, I'm beach bro. I'm off my gills and work, mate. Yeah. Me and Tim are hitting the club tonight. We're gonna get absolutely fat faced. You in cuss? Uh, I don't know, I've got all this work, like I said, got to teach in the morning. Yeah, we'll only be out till four. It's fine. Oh, alright then mate. See you in a bit. Awesome. <laughs> Mr. Cod! Mr. Cod! 
drunk, naked. Slow down, slow down. Claire, what's happening? Mr. Cod is running around, drunk and naked, around the school. Oh my God, Jesus Christ! Hello? 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 Jesus Christ, God, pay attention! I've had enough. You know, when you signed the contract to join this school, you were prohibited from being drunk in school, nudity, hiring strippers, dangerous driving, testing positive for horse tranquilizer, and many, many other things. This is something that the school likes to take very seriously, James. Do you understand me? You're just sitting there, smiling yourself up. Oh, Jesus Christ, the stink of haddock! You know, you remind me of one of my children. Thanks. I HATE MY CHILDREN! Look, you are on thin ice over a lake full of tuna. Do you know when you shot? Shut up, shut up, shut up, shut up! God. Right. When you walk out that door, you are on a very, very thin line. You tow that line one more time and you are gone. The axe will swing down. Do you understand me? There's no more second chances here. Do you understand? Mm. Now get out of here. What's that, boys? Oh, 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 oh. Whoa, baby face! What are you doing? I just had a rugby match. Do not read the school rules. You're meant to leave in school uniform, boy. I, it's just over there. I just to get have to leave school in school uniform. But I thought it. My just over there. Don't talk you with me, sunshine. I, fine. You wanna play rugby? Let's play rugby. <laughs> Three, two, one, clear! This one's a gunner, boys. Hello, the master. You said you wanted to see me? So, uh, what's this about? Take a seat. <coughs> no! Down with that end! And turn the goddamn light on! You are fired here! Done! Axed! Benito! Sacked! Kaput! You understand me? I don't want to see your face here ever again, you understand me? You're a disgrace, a fiend, a pathetic scoundrel. In all of my years of teaching here, I have never, NEVER seen anything like this. I want you to pack your things up and leave. I don't want to see your face here ever again. You got one hour, do you understand me? And if you do one more thing wrong, I swear to God, I will take things into my own hands. And you don't want to know what's going to happen next. Now get out of here before I kick your face in. Which member of the UFO team would you not break for on the crossing? <laughs> <laughs> um, it's dark, no one's around, you and them. To be honest, I think that might have happened already. Oh. Uh, Mr. Card. How are you? I'm not too bad. How are you? How was your meeting with the headmaster? Oh, it was really good actually. I told him, uh, told him the, how things were. I told him I was really enjoying the job. Are you firing? No, I, just, I was just like, I'm enjoying it. Had enough. See you later. How did he take that? Oh, I took it fine. He was like, yeah, I could see you hadn't been happy for a while. Mr. Card, I think you need a cup of tea. Oh, yeah, brilliant. Thank you. Nice jacket, Mr. Card. Okay. Think of these some elbow patches. There you go, Mr. Card. Enjoy that. Thank you very much. Have you thought about elbow patches? 
I did, but I wasn't too sure, so I thought I'd go without and get it tailor made, added on later if I thought. Maybe if you're next week. Don't you want to use a coaster, Mr. Cod? Oh no, I'm sure it's fine. I'm, I'm leaving in a couple of hours anyway. Don't you know what happened to the last teacher who didn't use a coaster? Okay, I'm actually getting a bit nervous and a bit worried about that. I you think know? you need to use a coaster, Mr. Cod. If the headmaster were to come in, I feel there could be issues. Uh, we're, we're, on, we're on a good playing surface now, so... There's an, an air of complacency that's making me feel very anxious. I'm feeling a bit troubled. It's, it's making me feel uncomfortable. Okay. Very uncomfortable. Well, how about if I, if I leave that there, uh, I'll go out and just pack. I'll resign. Okay. See you later. Good luck. I'm not happy with that. I'm good. Headmaster, um, how are you? Yeah, I'm good, thanks guys, how are you? Yeah, I'm good, good, good. Headmaster, really yeah, just really taking a bit of a, a, bit of a an important chat. Rushed off our feet. Whose is that? Um, what, I'm not, Headmaster. You, you, you all know that you need to use a coaster when you put a mug down. It's one uh, of the rules in the staff room. I've, I, don't, I don't set up many rules in the staff room, but that's one of the very few rules. You must use a coaster. Who did that? I, well, I always use coasters. I always use a coaster as well, so following that logic, I'm... The headmaster, you understand there's so much good stuff going on in school. Stop so making good, excuses. So many good lessons. Headmaster, there's other important things. We know this is important to you and we respect you, but there's other things going on, headmaster. I cannot tolerate this in the staff room. Do you understand? Headmaster, please. I'm the head of year 13. I've got a very What do you mean you're head of year 13? I'm the headmaster here. I'm clearly taller than you, headmaster. You have to understand that and you have to understand. I'm an award-winning department. The you best. do not forget the hierarchy in the school. I'm headmaster. Ah, gentlemen, look, this is getting a little bit out of hand. I want to get back to my award. The best IT department of a school in Reading whose name begins in R. Okay, look, I've got a solution to this. I've got a, you, you've got your award, headmaster. Please take one of these lapel badges. I can see that there might be elements of self, low self-esteem here. It's quite small. Have one of these lapel badges. No, I don't have time for this. Just, just tell me who did this it right now. It'll make you feel a lot... Please, Headmaster, it'll make you feel a lot better. Just take it. I'm not it's made a big difference to the lives of the 13 I'm not taking your lapel badge! Whose is this? Comprende. Amigo.
baby. Adios. So uh, we're very pleased to have you here at St. Fishwick School on such short notice to uh, fill the role of Head of Physics. Do you mind? Know? Yeah, sure. Come in. Ah, hi. Um, sorry to disturb your meeting. Um, I, I'm just pointing off to the doctors. Oh yes, of course. Um, did you manage to get the cover for the lesson? Oh, no, sorry, I, I forgot. Ah, perfect. Job's yours, we're starting straight away. Excellent. So I didn't quite catch your name. Macro. James Macro. <laughs> <laughs>